Let's go. <laughs> oh, we got one. Is that a oh, That was so clean. I saw him come up and eat it. What's going on? We are back out cheer, doing what we do best. Or, you know, what we like to think we're good at. This is round two of the editing process. We're back on the same tank of water. I'm gonna give her another go and, uh, you know, see what happens. I tried something different today, brought some worms. Mmm. Just to, uh, you know, see if there's anything on bottom, see if any big kitties live out here. And if so, we're gonna rip their damn heads off. Okay, stay tuned, stick with me, and uh, let's rip some lips. Yee! Show y'all a really simple and efficient knot. It's one of the knots I use all the time, polymer knot. Polymer knot. Can't feel my lips. What you do is you take your main line, I don't know if y'all can really see this, you take your main line, and then you're gonna double it over, right? So you have your main line next to your tag end, boom. And where you pinch it at, you're gonna double that over to a loop. You're gonna stick it through the eye, whatever bait you're using, pull it through. And then from that point, you're just gonna do it over under, just like you're tying your shoe, over under. And you're gonna pull it tight. And then at that point, you'll have this big O over here. And then you're just gonna put whatever lure you have through that O. And make sure it's all the way around. And then at that point, you can just pull the main and tag end line tight. And so just cinch down like so. Make sure you get a little spit on there, a little moisturizer. So your line doesn't eat into itself. Boom. And there you have it, polymer knot. You cut off your tag end here. Easiest knot in the world, and you're ready to throw. Easy, quick, efficient tie-ons, especially if you just missed that big one, you know, got snagged or something, trying to get back out there quickly. That's all you have to do, bada boom. go oh it's a small one. Oh no it's not keep tight keep tight keep tight keep tight yeah he's a little one oh my gosh oh my gosh it's an acrobat oh he is not happy come on come up here big boy come here that's a decent one Nice little pound and a half. Ooh! Oh, that's a little bit better. Oh, that's too. Oh, too cool! <laughs> that's not no pound and a half, baby. Oh my gosh. That's a solid two and a half, three, baby. Let's go. Oh my gatos. Bro talking about destroys the bait man oh my gosh it must have been swimming towards me that is freaking sick <laughs> oh i'm so stoked man you just freaking turned on here right now come on get out of there there he goes oh shit just rehooked him here we go. Let's go. Yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah. How we get it doing right here on Texas, baby? Boy. Clear that off your eye, baby. What a chunk. What a freaking chunk. That's a toad right there, man. That's a solid. Ooh, that's that's an easily three right there. Look at you, but I can tell, man. You got weight on them. That's high twos, if anything. Ooh, let's get it out there and do it again. Yeah.
Oh, we got one. Is that a... Oh, that's a good one, boy. That's a good one. That is a good one. Oh, come here, mama. Mama Sita, come to me. Uh. Freaking chowed it. Nasty flips, dog. Freaking acrobat. Come here, baby. Ooh. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> oh, come here, baby. Yeah, boy. Just pulled up to this other corner of the lake. That was the second cast. I know I shouldn't have turned my GoPro off. That's what's up, baby. Let's go. Oosh. A beautiful babe right there. What a babe. What a babe right in the corner. Get out of there. There she goes. That's number three of the day. Number three, babe. Beautiful fish. Let's get a release on this girly. All right, so just a quick show of what I've been throwing today. It's gonna be this guy right here, Berkeley Power Bait Swim Shad, pre-rigged, three inch, eight centimeters, one fourth of an ounce. One in a five count. I'm talking about lethal, lethal. I don't know if that's, I don't know if that's true. I missed a few fish. I'm talking about my hookup ratio. You know, it's not 100% all the time. It never is for any angler. But these baits right here are definitely my most successful. Uh, they have the three inch one, and then they also have, like they have different colors. Never caught anything on that color. That's why I just go with the natural, natural swim shad. Uh, and then I did have some Mondo ones in here, but I think I took them out. I think I threw them away because, well, they're a little too big. But, you know, there's some lunkers out here. I guarantee it. But, you know, just too big for my uh, preference. You know, it's like like half ounce, four inch, 10 centimeter jig, swim jig. I was like, ah, that's, that's way too big. Now, if I was going somewhere where I knew there was like big lunkers hiding, I would definitely choose that to throw. But other than that, man, those are like, I don't know, four bucks a pack. I'm about to go actually get some more because I'm down to my last two. And uh, yeah, I'm about to call it a day here. Gonna throw a couple more lines in. Might have a little bit more action. But other than that, I'll catch y'all in a minute. Oh, that was so clean. I saw him come up and eat it. Oh, what's up, Bubba? Yes, yeah, sir, he's trying to shake it. Not today. Come here, baby. Come here, baby. Oh my gosh. Woo! Let's go. <laughs> right in the top of the mouth. Every single time. Every single time. Look, it just came out like that, too. Boom. Look at that pretty boy. Nice green, bass green. Oh my gosh, dude, they're so freaking beautiful. So freaking beautiful. I love these fish, man. Mwah, give you a kiss. Mwah. Oh god. That's nice. Oh, yep. Awesome. Alright, man. Fishing is a sport second to none. If that ain't the truth, I don't know what is, man. I'm about to get out of here. My GoPro's about to die. I was just casting around just a little bit more. Oh, that's so dope. I watched him come up and eat it. Can I take you home? Will you be my friend? 
<laughs> oh man, you cannot beat that feeling. Oh gosh, stuck in the mud. Woo! Let's go. <laughs> All right, so that is going to wrap it up. That was so sick, man. That was so sick. That was one of the best days of fishing I've had in a few months. So. To say the least, I'm super stoked. Definitely appreciate y'all uh, watching this far. If you stuck along with me, you're super dope too. Definitely appreciate that. Make sure you get out and wet a line here soon. If you don't know how, you know, it's so easy. It's so simple, so much fun. It's pure, it's wholesome. <laughs> but no, I definitely seriously appreciate all the love and support that I get from everybody that does show. And I just know that, you know, it is reciprocated. I definitely appreciate it. Again, if you want to check these out, Berkeley Power Bait. It is the easiest lure, easiest beginner's lure. Obviously, as you can tell from the footy right now, it catches fish and it's simple. It's just simple. All you have to do is cast it out and reel it in. Literally all I did all day. Didn't have any luck with any other lures, but uh, you know what? That's just how the cookie crumbles. And I'm definitely gonna get back out here soon enough. I know there has to be at least a five pound fish in this little tank of water. If not here, I might hit up a uh, bigger, bigger tank. I might go out to a bigger lake. I don't know. And that's the good thing about fishing. Great thing about fishing is there's so much to explore. There's so many things you can learn on a daily basis. Every single time you go out, it's a new learning experience. So with that being said, I'm gonna chunk douches, douches, can't say that. I'm gonna chunk the deuce, peace out. As always, tight lines and good times. Peace.